Hey dad, can I go to Mars? No. You have school today. Now get in the car so we can go to school. Dang, I wanted to go to Mars. Instead I have to go to boring old school. Wait a minute, I have an idea. I am going to sneak out of school and then go to NASA so I can go to Mars. This plan is foolproof. Hello, can I help you? Uh, I must be in the wrong place. Got to get back to class. Well great, I forgot about the receptionist. I will have to go out through the other exits and climb the fence. Phew that was difficult climbing the fence. But I am out of this place. Time to go to NASA. One ticket to Mars please. Yeah. That's not how it works kid. Oh uh. I want to go to Mars. Finish school. Go to college and become an astronaut. Even if you were to do that we have not been able to get anyone on Mars so that won't be happening. Wah! I want to go to Mars I want to go to Mars I want to go to Mars I want to go to Mars. Wah! Look kid. I don't know who you are or where you belong but I'm calling the police. At this point you are trespassing and you will need to leave. Dang it. I will not leave until you get me a ticket to Mars. Well then suit yourself but I am calling police since you are refusing to leave. Thanks for coming today. We have a young boy somewhere around the age of 6 or 7 who is refusing to leave. Alright, and do you want to have him trespassed? Yes. All right, I will go have a word with him. Hello there, do you know why I was called in? Oh uh, no. Okay, so the reason I was called in today is because you are refusing to leave this place. Normally I would arrest someone who is refusing to leave but you are young and you have so much ahead of you so I won't be arresting you today. You will be left off with a warning. Well phew. I can give you a ride back home. Do you know your home address? Well, it's 4903 West Simplex Road. All right, got it. You can come with me now and I will give you a ride back home. So Caillou, is this your first time getting in trouble with the law? Yes, I believe so. I see, well I don't want you getting in trouble with the law again. I myself got in trouble with the law when I was 15. I did some sick twisted pranks on people with friends, and went into juvenile detention for a few days. I learned my lesson afterward and broke ties with my old friends, because they were bad influence. I think you should do the same. Well my friend Leo never gets in trouble. Sometimes he advises me not to do certain things. Well that's good you have some mature friends. Alright Caillou, looks like we are here. And remember, stay out of trouble. Caillou, where have you been? I got a call from the school saying that you were missing. And why did a police officer drop you off? I will get that. You stay here. Good afternoon sir. Are you this boy's father? Yes, I am. Why? What did he do? Your son went to the NASA space station and begged to go to Mars. He also showed immature behavior there and refused to leave. He is trespassed from there and is not allowed to go there for a year, however since he is young and has a lot ahead of him, I decided not to arrest him. He is being let off with a warning. My deep apologies officer. I can assure you I will take disciplinary action and you will not do this sort of stuff again. Alright then. You have a good rest of your afternoon. Caillou, I am rather disappointed in you. How could you do such stupid things? This is the third time this semester you skipped class. Also I went to the school to pick up some homework packets and borrowed textbooks. We're making up for the missed classes. And also you are so grounded for one week. During this one week you will work hard in school and be studious, and you will be doing chores around the house. Go in the kitchen. We will start making up for the missed classes. Wah!